make every shot count. Introducing the all-new Predator 314 and Z high-performance shafts. Reloaded with new technology for unprecedented accuracy. Predator. Engineering victory. Welcome back to our live coverage of the Predator French Open 2015. You're watching eBilliard.tv. I'm Joe Chance. I'm here with Christophe Monza. And we are back. We are back. On a match between Evo Arts and Tony Drago. Seems that we still have some issues with the, the audio. And. Uh, I don't know if you are hearing me correctly, so we'll try some tests during the game. Don't be surprised. So big game for the last 16 between Evo Arts from Netherlands and Tony Drago from Malta. Yeah, place in the quarterfinals at stake here for either Evo or Tony. Mark Pistebosch, he's already secured his place in the quarterfinal with a shutout win, 9-0 over Boris Lee. Pretty surprising to see a shutout, I guess, but we know what uh, Mark is capable of. Yeah, but to me, it's very surprising. We've had uh, the shape of Boris during the last week, so we know nine ball is quick, can be quick. And uh, sometimes all is on, uh, on your side and sometimes not. Maybe it was the case for uh, four boys this time. And we just saw an interesting uh, choice on the five by Evo. He found a good place for a safety. And uh, he made it pretty, pretty good. And now um, maybe even if Tony made a great effort, Free race first. It's a foul and then ball in hand for. Yeah, the safety paid off. And uh, we just heard some applause from the from the ground, and uh, that was because Zivo Markov from Argentine, my room, just won 9-7 against uh, Del Sim of the UK. Yes, sorry. Good win for Ivo Markov after earlier eliminating Stefan Cohen. One of the favourites for the tournament, so he continues his good run. He's through to the last 16. Ivo played himself into trouble here. Hooked himself behind the nine and mm -hmm. was forced to take on a jump, which he's now missed. Tony is going to be looking to run out the last two balls. He's going to be wasting no time. Mm. Too bad for. Too bad for this. For for Ivo for the for the first or for for the opening rack I mean he had the ball in hand on four balls and uh, he had to capitalize after a good safety shot he didn't make it one down now watch out Ivo don't let the tornado in front. Battle of youth and experience here. 
21-year-old Ivo Arch from yeah. the Netherlands up against 50-year-old Tony Drago with a, a wealth of experience yeah. behind him in snooker and American pool. Sure, but Ivo made a lot of European championships, youth and uh, in in uh, all categories, and he made also a lot of Euro Tour tournaments. So um, I don't think experience is a is a big factor there. And you know what? Tony plays with the, the speed of a 21-year-old, I think. <laughs> Not sure. The way I'm knowing 21. Around the table. I'm knowing young guys who are playing very slowly, no? So, good defense, good safety from, good safety from Ivo there. Not enough to prevent a, a, a slight touch on the Little one by Tony. And Tony finds the safety. Okay, here we go again. Mm, this time. Oh. I think he got him this time. Yeah, I think he, he got it. Pretty close wow. that the, the, the previous is situation. There, oh, maybe there is a corridor between the three and the nine. Once again, tight. I'm not sure. Yeah, I don't think he, uh, there is. Yeah. You can't make a zigzag with the, the cue ball, Joe. So. Let's see. <laughs> He's played an intentional foul here. Yeah. Didn't fancy taking on a taking on a, a more complicated escape route. So he's decided to complicate the table for his opponent. Evo will now presumably be looking at going off of two rails, oh perhaps, yeah. to and try contact to the three and yes. bring it out into the open. Exactly. Try to contact something. Maybe the nine. That's just... Pretty good job. Oh, yeah. That's Gonna just have perfect. have to play the six, but which slightly complicates matters, but yeah. it's yeah. got a nice queuing position. And you have to control the three after the contact of the six. I mean, yes. That's a lovely... Nice. By the way, if you're following the tournament brackets and scores on videoport.com, we're running a little bit ahead of schedule Watch today. Out. Watch out. Okay. This match is due for a six o'clock start. We're about half an hour ahead of that, so it's good news for us. Maybe we'll finish a bit early tonight. Thought we were going to be here until 2, 3 in the morning. Mm -hmm. Still, we'll yeah. see. Yeah, but no. You can't forecast uh, the duration of the games, so maybe we learn some time there, but we will have a two hours games just after, so. Could be 9 0, could be 9 8 yep. in any given match. So, uh, as you said, it can be over in the blink of an eye or it can last a very long time. Typically, when Tony Drago is in town, it the wrecks get run through pretty quickly. But Evo Arts is a more than capable opponent. So, this is a probably a 50 50 shout. Could go either way. On maybe not maybe not fifty fifty for everybody, but uh, I think that you can say that with a, a special situation of the of the nine ball on the spot. With this kind of uh, situation, you most of the time you have. You have uh, clusters or problems on the table, so it's rare to have an open, an open, a real open table. Yeah, Evo Arts is taking advantage of the dry break by Tony Drago. He's shooting an open table, but he does have a couple of the balls. Up in the top right hand corner of the screen to worry about the seven and the eight. And the four. The big four or so just before that. Yeah, he's giving himself a bit of angle now to move over. Uh-huh. 
Uh -huh. Maybe he has something in mind. Safety Possible shot. Safety. safety shot behind the nine. With two rays or only one, depends on what you are choosing, chosen for. For the quantity. Okay. Two rays. Didn't hide it, but mm. the cue ball was tucked right up against the yeah. top rail. He definitely wanted to use the, the nine ball as a blocker. He yeah. is a little bit too long, too long on the on the shot. Same for Tony. The five was a the blocker and uh, wow. Yeah, just hit the underside of it, kicking from the top rail. Uh, Tony is going to work out how to deal with the seven and eight problem. He seemed to be pointing at the place in the cue ball where he wanted to be shooting the six to go up towards the seven and the eight. He's got a possible billiard from the seven onto the eight to make the ball. You have different options. You can also play the carom. With the with the cue ball, contact on the seven on the bronze seven and uh, pocketed the the eight with the, the cue ball. Or trying to move those balls after playing the six. Yeah, it's a risky option if he was to try to move them. Okay, he changed his plan because he. He firstly wanted to move the balls and now he's gonna have to play the carom. Yeah, but not a good shot. Yeah, you gotta not only making the ball is just, it's just gonna be a challenge with a carom like that, you've also got to think about position on the, the first ball you hit and he didn't make either really. Okay, not an easy, not an easy two balls, two balls run for for Evo from there. Maybe a lot of speed and uh, okay, or less speed and good control. That's okay. With <laughs> Tony doesn't doesn't want to wait, so he gave. He gave up the, the frame. 2 1 Evo. Is it the day of for the Evos? Could be. Haha. -ha. Evo Markov through to the last 16. Evo Arts has a chance to go through to the last eight. Yeah, Chris. Uh, Chris Seville, his match against Hugh GC is just getting underway. That's a match in the last 16 as well. No Brunoig is tied up at 5 5 against Robin Cripps, who we saw on our stream just two matches ago. Safety from Arts. Mm -hmm. There is a room for Tony when we were first. Yeah, I get the contact on the on the pink four, so the result is not so good for him. And now he was uh, an open shot on the one. Natural replacement for the two and something. 
pretty easy for the free or so. Watch out how to manage uh, to get out the free and to find something good on the four. Okay. Maybe using uh, using the black the black eight uh, as a broker and to find a position on the pink in order to play the left side pocket. I'll be trying to pass between the nine and the and the black eight. Okay, you can avoid everything or so, that's good. Okay, so main goes on this orange five. Watch out your speed. You have to keep control of the cue ball and then to have an easy seven, round seven. One way after contact, two ways. Okay, good speed, good control. Seven, eight and nine remaining on the table now for Ivo Arts. He's got off to the better start in this last 16 matchup. Set to take a 3 1 lead. Nine deposited. It's going to be Tony Drago to break in rack five. Wrecking up the balls using the magic rack. Remember, it's the nine on the spot in this match. And tournament, similar to Euro Tour rules, three balls must pass the head string or be pocketed for it to be considered a legal break, otherwise control passes. And if you make the resume of the on the game until there, uh, Tony scored after a mistake from Ivo at 0-0. Zero zero. He missed a, 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 a to clear to clear the table uh, with uh, four balls to come and ball in hand. The only big mistake from Ivo so far. So, really good start for the young guy. Yeah, one of a number of rising Dutch talents. They seem to produce a lot of them. We've got Tim de Reuter, now eliminated from this tournament, but himself, Mark Bistobosch, and Ivo Arts, all young players under the age of 22 already at a level where they can go head to head with some of the great poor players in in europe and the world like tony drago as you can see tony's trademark style involves not Wasting any time on the table, gets straight down on the shot, fires it in. Oof. A little, little worry there for Tony on, on the nine ball. Yeah. It wiped its feet on the way into the pocket. 3 2 though. Played a nice bank shot, opening up the rack there, Tony, and that's a quick yeah. break and run. Aggressive choice at the beginning of the rack and. Uh, Paid off. Yeah. One and the two balls and down. Three balls pretty nice up by the bottom right hand corner pocket. 
Hmm, what a nice shot. Yeah, that's pretty nicely controlled off of the rail. Wow. Knew the exact line he needed to come back up the table to get on the four. This looks like a good opportunity for Evo to reply with a break and run of his own. Yeah. And the only uh, thing he has to manage right now is to find a position on for the bracket on the left side of the table because of the position of the of the yellow and white nine. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. Wow. Maybe he was thinking Took about quick. Yeah, maybe he was thinking already about the end of the table and didn't stay focused, really focused. Oh you you on the missed as well. Yeah. Wow. Just when you just when it seemed like Arts was getting into his comfort zone, missed a simple six ball and Allowed Tony Drago back in. He's going to level the score up now, 3-3. Three, three. Wow. Yeah. Well, that was a pretty inexplicable miss. He lost his focus, I think. Too, too easy. Pretty straight, six ball. A little follow, find something good on the seven and to, to keep the, the cue ball on the left side of the of the table. It was for him, it was maybe... maybe the end before the end, so... Too easy, right? Yeah, sure, sure. First time I heard that, <laughs> maybe he should have had a long, tricky shot. Might have preferred it. Yeah. Yeah. Funny old game, Paul. Or maybe uh, if the score is about 7-7, uh, <laughs> he, 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 he took some time between the 6 and the 7 to watch the, the correct angle of the 7 and so on. So after that, he didn't, he didn't miss this, this, uh, this, seven, this 6 ball. So, you know, the game is uh, on the start. I mean, 3 all or 3 2 before this mistake. Tony's made a nice break. Yeah. In rack seven. Eight ball down already. And you, you and it's possible to have in a few seconds, because it's Tony on the on the table, uh, a four three for him. And uh, we could expect four three for Evo. At least. So it yeah, yeah, cost him. I got to cost him a lot. We see that. Better of the opening regs, Evo Arts. Had a 3 1 lead, but a couple of mistakes. Yeah. Sees him now facing a deficit after this nine ball. 4 3. In a matter of moments. Tony Drago has turned a 3-1 advantage for his opponent into a 4-3 advantage for himself. So he has to, to react right now. A good break will help. I said a Six good break will help. Okay. Push out coming from Tony Drago. Mm -mm. Now is the choice to take this or give it back. I pretty classical, be taking it. pretty classical safety shot to come, I think. Yeah, he's gonna send the cue ball up oh, the table. Maybe a little too thick. Okay. The result is not bad, but I'm not sure that it was his choice. Oh.
miss from Eva Works and Yake. That's Tony Drago back in. Tony Drago got to the final of the Paris Open in 2011, four years ago now. Could be looking another successful run. Fell out of the last 16 stage last year. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Looks like could be going at least one stage further in 2015. Seven ball wobbled a little bit on its way in. Now up five three. Yeah. He faced Nick Vandenberg in that final in 2011. If they keep winning, they're going to face each other in the final again this year. But there's a long way to go. Tony. Yeah, and uh, that's a kind of emergency for Ivo now. If uh, Tony has a good view on the first ball to play, and uh, he can be, could be, could be free, uh, free up after this rack. So don't let the tornado go forward and, and go ahead. That's important for the for the game for uh, for your own confidence. The tornado is starting to twist into action. Yeah. Winds firing ahead. To be a rocky road for Evo Arts if he wants to get back into this one. Yeah. He does not look likely to miss at the moment, Tony. And and with this quickness, in 10 minutes, the game is over. Yeah, he's not wasting any time. Oh, Looking maybe a little bit short. Short, yeah, yeah, short, but thin. Yeah, now. yeah, cool. 6-3. Woo, 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 6-3. 10 minutes ago, the score was 3-1. It's 5 on the spin. Yeah. All of our... Last 16 matches are underway now. All bar one. Any other matches? Noel Brunoy against Robin Cripps is finally poised at 6 6. VGC is up 3 2 over Chris Seville. Mermajid has taken the first rack in his match against Aziz Musati. 1 0 there. And for my friend from Argenteuil, uh, Ivailo Markov is going to play Vincent Faquet in this last 16 game. Another big match for Ivo. Still alive in this big tournament. Big tournament. Better without S. What a break. What a break from Ivo. And uh, yeah. Sorry, three, three, three balls. Yes. I can't count. And uh, he he really needs this 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 rack. No mistake from there. Yeah, good. Uh, yes, to secure something good on the six. Maybe playing this six on the. Right side of the pocket, yeah. Watch out your speed, be precise. The side pocket there are not very easy to play. Wow, with a lot of speed, with a lot of confidence, nice shot. Uh, he's, he's got a mango, so I think he has to follow on this one. I don't know. Maybe a big draw with a. Watch, watch out the contact. The watch out the contact. Oh, he's good. <laughs> Just slowed up where it needed to. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He 
didn't have to be shorter. Two, two centimeters short, shorter, and it was it was a hard shot to make. Six four. Called for a momentum, Joe. Momentum, momentum. I mean, if uh, Tony has a bad roll on the break, it could yeah, be the chance for Ivo. You can't control what Tony Drago does on his own break. If it's anything like the last couple of breaks, it's yeah. going to be winning another rack. We'll have to see what he produces on this break. Was that an illegal break, Christoph? I don't know. I was uh, thinking about something else, sorry. Eva's at the table. Just made the two. Oh. Played the billiard, answered the five with success. Leaves himself decent shape on the three. Come back down the table for the four. Could be a potential shift in momentum, as you oh. said, Christoph. Yeah, but you have to secure something good on the on the black eight because of the of the nine. They are both close to the right long rail, and uh, the best thing is to stay there after contact. Maybe a very smooth shot. Yeah, watch out your speed. It's not an easy one. Yeah, it's, it's an important right one, corner. but not an easy one. Good shot. 6-5 now. Yeah. And the break for Evo Arts. didn't fall on the side pocket, on the left side pocket. That's a near goal break. Only one ball down. Mm, this was an important shot from from Ivo this this break and uh, yeah, one ball down, but none past the head string. Means an illegal break and. Like Tony Drago could take full advantage. Is a six pass on the top right corner? I don't think so. Doesn't look that way on the screen. Looks like the nine is blocking the path. Tony's having a chat with himself, wondering where he's going to play the next shot. Maybe the combo? Oh. Oh, short. Wants that ball to keep rolling, and it's slowed oh, up. Oh, he, wa he wanted to pass it and to play it on the on the bottom uh, of the table, and he didn't make it. So too too short. A very easy safety shot, maybe the behind the Oof. behind the eight. Um, yeah, yeah. He was miscued on that. He had yeah. a bit of awkward queuing. And I think he was seeing a piece of this six and can make a 
pretty usual safety shot. Maybe a bank. Bank time. Just kidding, of course. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, short. This one is very short. Wow. Yeah, Tony's gonna fire at this. Or maybe safety behind the seven. Or maybe he's fired this. Fires it into the heart of the pocket. Yeah, yeah. Big mistake. Just, just uh, a couple of second, couple of minutes from Ivo and second one. It's gonna to be seven five for Tony. If you remember the mistakes, just caught could be very very different as we have now that's that's a game 7 5 Tony Drago and the break to come mm. yeah illegal break was punished there yeah everything is gonna to be hard now for uh, for Evo he has to to start to and to uh, to close the gap again against Tony, that's not uh, he, he made it one time. He has to make it another time, and start now. Six, six, seven, six could be very nice for him. Five, eight, and uh, on the side. yeah, maybe the second one now. No, short. Another ball dropped, so I think it was a legal break. I think it's, it's a legal break, but yeah. And then okay. Now, what does he leave? Possible jump shot? Oh, one, one way first, on the bottom of the, of the table. Bottom short rail, rail just before the two ball with quickness okay. because you have to go Where out. Oh, that's a uh, little unlucky to tie up the five and the nine. That's lucky and unlucky. Lucky that he, he found he found a, a good corner on the two, but uh, he touched a little, the just slightly the, the orange five and created a, a cluster. And he's too, yeah, too thick on the on the orange five. And he got no result after this contact. So safety time, guy. Okay, maybe too long. Yeah, I think he's is, he is too long on this one. one. Yeah, I think so. Oh yeah. Wow. Second big mistake from Evo. Yeah, he played it pretty quick, safety, and didn't cover using the seven ball. Yeah, was pretty frustrated after the after this uh, little slight contact on the, the orange five, and uh, didn't keep uh, his focus. Wow, close to be eight five for Tony and Tony Drago on the hill. It's always hard to catch. It's going to be hard to catch on the hill yeah, now. Yeah, sure. Get five up. <laughs> Eva Wyatt is in the last chance saloon. And my buddy Eva Markov is leading by one. One zero against Vincent Fake. Come on, buddy. Long way to go in that match. Sure, but he's leading. Old French encounter. If we're claiming Evo is French. Yeah, a part of him is French, sure. One ball took a nice contact off the jaw of the side pocket and that is what caused it to drop. Otherwise it would have been a dry break. <coughs> However, nothing doing on the two ball. 
And in one, Majid is continue his uh, perfect, perfect way on this tournament. He's leading 3-0, as is, as is Mozati on just 16 game. to the push out from Evo on the break. He used to, used to push the tie up the four and the five slightly and complicate matters on the bottom rail. Tony Drago fired at the bank, missed it. And now Evo replies with a miss of his own. Okay. long safety shot again. You see that the players has, have, have some difficulties to control the speed when they are, they are playing safe. Okay, another bad one, but Tony will see something on the two, yeah. So the contact with the six, uh, with the six, but it's just nice perfect. Yeah. Contact maybe helped it. Yeah. Now all, all is about the combo four five. We've got on the bottom yeah. of the table. Let's see how he deals with that. Watch out the corner pocket. Whoa. Lucky it slowed down. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, it was a bit funny. It was a bit off angle. The four and the five. Sure. I wondered if he might have chosen to play a carom instead, but went for the combination and missed it. It was it wasn't a good the good speed anyway. I mean that's uh, we watch uh, the position uh, of the cue ball after the contact uh, with the four, very close to the four at the end. So not the, the best shot from Tony there. And this is a good shot if he's got the speed. Ooh. He doesn't have a good view on the five, on the six, sorry, and I don't know if he can touch, uh, may even thinner this shot, this, even thin this, uh, this ball, no. And oh, maybe he can, it can kill him yeah, this way, Great yes. kick shot from Evil Arts. Nice shot, nice recovery. It was all in on that shot. Oh yeah, it was, it was make, make or lose shot and uh, he made it watch Training out on in this match he's going to bring it back to 8 6 yeah 8 6 he's smiling a little after this uh, first ray shot and, uh, it's 6 he made on the bottom left corner 8 6 you want to bet? I'm not a betting man. See, sure you are. But you want to win, you have, you have to, to bet the opposite of your choice. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to put a curse on anyone. But Tony's going to have this opportunity to break and run out, plus another one if, he, if it does go to 8-8. Eight, eight. So if I was a betting man, I wouldn't be putting my money against Tony Drago. That's for sure. Now Evo has a really, real hope <laughs> for Tony. He can thank me afterwards <laughs> for putting the curse on. Yeah, Tony's pretty straight here. Needs to hit, hit this one pretty hard to come out. Well, he's left it, <coughs> left the cue ball. Not too far away from the bottom rail, so elected to leave distance rather than trying to do anything too flashy with the cue ball. It's a bit of a halfway shot there. Yeah, it's a pretty usual it. safety shot there. Maybe too long again, too long again. Yes, too long again. When you have trouble to control the the speed of the cue ball on this kind of shot. Try to to uh, to choose to to make less distance 
or less, a short, a short way for from the cue ball maybe. If you control the cue ball behind the blockers, whatever the position of the of the object ball is okay. Tony played a fired at the combination attempt on the on the two, which he didn't make, and hmm. Evo just played a pretty hmm. spectacular very combination quick, shot. Very quick choice. Three ball went into the side pocket. Nine ball flew into the top corner. Yeah, very quick choice. Eight seven now. Aha. Uh -huh. Is the black cat on Tony the pool room? A little bit flustered. Firing at the combination. Didn't pay off for him, but three to the nine paid off for Evo Arts. Another close match on our live stream coverage, eBilliard.tv. Thanks to our sponsors, Predator, title sponsor of the French Open 2015. Kamui as well, sponsors of the Billiard coverage and the Kamui battle, which took place Friday night. Eva made another illegal break. So Tony has come to the table, and how ironic would it wow. be if Tony was to punish another illegal break with a clearance, wow. which would seal the match? Okay. Cruel. Okay, see, see the five and the four. The four and the five, and the key is there. Find a good position for the five. Yeah, it's a challenge. The angle that he's looking at now, it's not easy. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Watch out. Don't be just before the six. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. It's a very different, difficult queuing. Yeah. And Try to bank it. And Ooh, yeah, leave yeah. something on. I've seen Tony. Smash his fist down on the table in anger there. Uh -huh. He's frustrated, not being able to get out. He thought he had a good okay. opportunity there. Okay. He has some work to do anyway. I mean, uh, find something good on the six. The nine is not helping with the position. Okay. He tried to okay, choose a, um, an, average, an average position. I mean, not easy one, but not... Uh, an odd one, and now he has to make some draw on this one and to avoid the contact. He made the contact on the yes. nine. Go on, guy. It is time to, to call Rico, the god of the recovery. Kick this one in. <laughs> he will be yeah, united. Right. Yes, he might need some divine help. I would, sh I would show the opposite side. I mean, uh, two way first and uh, try to use the, the nine as a broker potentially. But okay, play the other one. Will he get lucky? Uh, will he get lucky? Look at the seven. Wow. 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 Of all the wow. places it could have ended up on the table. Yeah, to end the rows are for, are for evil so far. And Tony's played a kind of snooker defense shot yeah. there, which Little bit hasn't really short. paid off because evil can make this. He doesn't this make cup, it. Though. And he's close and to the end right now. Could be game uh, over. Oh, it could be, yeah. But watch out the position on the on the on the eight. Uh, okay, it pretty usual shot across the table. Yeah. And back. Three rays after sh after contact. Two rays is better for Tony. And you choose the two rays, and it's pretty perfect for the for the winning ball. Nine seven. Tony Drago seals the victory over Evo Arts. Just uh, just took advantage of a few mistakes from Evo, despite some nice queuing and spectacular shots from the Dutchman. 
to Tony Jago who prevails to go through to the quarterfinal. We're going to take a break on eBilliard.tv now. Keep following the tournament with our live streaming. Keep watching the brackets at eBilliard.billiardport.com. We'll see the other scores in the last 16 matches and we'll be back very shortly with quarterfinal action. Thanks for watching, everybody. Call your mates, call your friends, share on the social medias for us and so on. We have to record two bits. So a, li a little break, about how many times? We still don't know. So be still on, okay? We'll Stay with you us, when you control when your... There's going to be another match coming up, don't worry, don't go anywhere. Yeah, please. See you, bye.